Meat bicycle! Hello everybody, welcome back to part 2 of Speed Farming 101 here on Borderlands 2. This is the series where I take you through the entire game uh, in parts and show you how to farm every single boss in the game for their legendary or unique items and weapons uh, the fast way. So we'll go with all characters, I'll show you the best routes, any skips uh, and just a damn good fast rocket jumping gunzerker route as well. So we are here in Southern Shelf today uh, and we're going to be farming Boom Boom. Uh, so we came from part 1 in Windshear Waste um, over from Knuckle Dragger to here in the uh, centre of Southern Shelf. So from down there uh, and we land here in this town and I'm going to be showing you uh, the fastest ways to speed farm uh, Boom Boom which uh, is part of the mission, the main story mission where you head to uh, Captain Flynn. Boom Boom's arena is just down there so we've got to go down there and farm him for his legendary weapon, um, sorry his legendary grenade which is the bonus package. So this is the normal route that you will take uh, down to Boom Boom uh, and we'll do one quick sped up run of that right now as well uh, and then I'll show you guys exactly how to make this faster and a couple of ways of actually getting there much quicker. So let's go for the normal run right away. So to get to Boom Boom right away we're going to speed this up a hell of a lot. You're going to run all the way down here uh, towards this little town. Branch to the left if you're just farming because there's a couple of enemies there that will slow you down. Head into this little shanty town right here, turn to the left, over the bridge, drop down and you are here. Uh, so the first thing you'll see is Little Boom, he'll come towards you uh, with his jetpack bouncing and uh, just generally trying to distract you. Just be careful, make sure you hide behind the barriers because Big Boom is in Big Bird for that huge turret that shoots loads of stuff at you and it will put you down pretty quickly. So make sure you run, keep jumping and take that down as quickly as you can because it does cause a lot of damage. Once Big Bird is down, Big Boom will pop out and then you can go and kill him as well. Both booms. Uh, drop the bonus package. You actually have two times chances at getting a bonus package from one of these and even before in the past very rarely I've actually had both booms drop to two separate bonus packages um, so that is good. So that is both of them down right now. Now you can see that's quite a long run even though I sped it up on the actual video it's still quite a long farm so there is a couple of ways to make this much quicker. One main way in general, I'm going to show you this with all characters at first and then show you the couple of different ways you can actually do it. But this applies for all characters, uh, the actual setup itself. So we are here obviously at the uh, fast travel to Southern Shelf, but there is a travel uh, down there. There is a walkway down to Three Horns. Now this comes after you actually complete the main story mission. You actually have to go all the way up to uh, Captain Flint which is uh, as you can see I'm showing you the route right now this is the first time you play it in the main story mission you head up to Captain Flint you kill him there is a this boat that I'm talking about is actually originally up there which will take you to three horns after you uh, go through it and go into three horns divide um, you can then come back and it will be right here so the boat has actually come down to the very bottom and as you can see it's much closer to Boom Boom's arena so once we go through that turn around come back from Three Horns it will bring you out at this point from then on until he goes anywhere else once you save out um, say, sorry, save the game quit out and come back in you will always spawn right here get these blooming racks out of the way so uh, we're going through right now to Three Horns Divide turn around come back um, and this is just basic positioning so in, with a lot of um, speed farms you're going to see that uh, we're going to position ourselves in certain walkways that are closer to the actual enemy themselves so this is the first example of it right now and uh, now from whenever we quit out and come back in we will always spawn right here uh, and as you can see from the map once again this is much quicker we're just going to go across here and into boom boom's arena much much quicker a lot closer uh, and you don't even have to run around that big shanty town uh, and across the bridge like that you can just simply run to that point right there and either grenade jump or rocket jump or both um, uh, depending on how you feel about it and uh, yes yeah, straight into boom boom's arena so instead of running all the way down there we've just got to go from here and over to there and I'll show you that right now so we're going to start off our first run this is uh, all characters including Krieg uh, who's a lot heavier obviously uh, you can actually do this with Krieg with a uh, grenade jump 
with a bada boom rocket launcher low level as well that will get you easily over there um, so yeah anyway cross the path cross the ice and head up to this uh, highest point of the snow next to uh, boom boom's arena make sure you unequip your grenade mod which i'm about to do right now this has to be without a grenade mod uh, actually place down and just drop it down somewhere near this wall not too much so it bounces far from the wall and then you're going to stand on top jump and there you go look straight over to boom boom's arena boom boom will already be there prepped ready waiting for you because you're so close to him and the turret is at the complete opposite side of the uh, of where you actually spawn in so it takes him a very long time to actually turn it to shoot at you uh, which is pretty good really i'm gonna get a nice little surprise on this run as you can see if you've got very good eyes you will see there was a flash of orange there as we killed big boom and there you go we have got ourselves a bonus package so that is the easiest and quickest way to do it with all characters and you don't even need a bada boom launcher to do that either um, now speaking of bada boom launchers it's time to try a run with the rocket jumping gun zerker so we've got two bada booms here to speed us up uh, and this actually doesn't require you any grenade jumping at all of any sort because you're just simply going to um, rocket jump your way to the arena and then just simply hop over the barrier like that then pull out uh, something like twin north fleet something that will absolutely wreck um, him and uh, you can use the uh, the Harold and Grog method on this one as well if you want but it's much quicker with uh, two North Fleets and as you can see absolute destruction and a very quick kill of boom so uh, you can actually kill these guys uh, look another bonus package that's two now uh, you can actually kill these guys very quickly every 30 seconds or so using this method quit out come in kill quit out come in kill it's very fast and it's also worth mentioning as well uh, with any character you don't even need to grenade jump you can just simply bring a uh, bada boom rocket launcher with a sham shield and uh, just it's close but uh, you can just get onto the edge of the barrier and jump over as well so if you're not very good at grenade jumping but you do know how to uh, to rocket jump and you have the right setup for it then you can just simply run to the top of the barrier right here and you can see hop onto this ledge which is uh, kind of an invisible ledge and then hop over once again so uh, yeah proof right there it can be done with all characters pretty easily uh, but especially as always with these farms a rocket jumping gun zerka will eat these guys up very very quickly indeed so uh, yeah there you go guys i'm just going to uh, do a couple of runs of these guys quit out and come back in and just show you how fast it can actually be uh, but that is um speed farming 101 nice and easy a bit more complicated than the uh, the first episode which was knuckle dragger which was very simple it was just about basic positioning uh, and very fast farming of him boom boom takes a little bit more you do have to actually rocket jump or grenade jump but like i said it's much much quicker than spawning in from the uh, the walkway at uh, fast sorry fast travel at southern shelf and then coming all the way down just remember though once you finish the farm you will end up at this boat so you will have to go to a fast travel uh, and go there and that will reset it and you won't appear at that boat anymore but for as long as you're doing these i do recommend spawning in that boat and then just hopping over the barrier like so so we're very fast farms here and uh, yeah hopefully that helps you guys out so that is part two knuckle dragger done and now boom boom so we're going to go on to part three next which will be midmong over in southern shelf bay much trickier and a bit harder farm that but uh, yeah look forward to that anyway so thank you guys for watching really hope you've enjoyed speed farming 101 here on bonus 2 and uh, yeah i'll see you guys in the next one